Hey yo, welcome everybody to a new game here called Forager. Shout out to the developer of Forager. He allowed me to have a closed beta key. And guess what? You could get a closed beta key too if you join the Forager Discord. Hey, you know what you should also do? You should visit the game on Steam. Because I'm pretty sure it's a uh, it's got a steam page it's like one of the greenlit things but here we are it's a game it's in early beta or closed beta so it is still buggy but let's get to it. i saw fury playing this and i was like hey this game looks cool let's play it if you guys think it's cool we can do a playthrough on it i don't know but we're about to figure this out together that's what iron looks like i've been taught by so many different games that iron has a different color oh look at this it's like fortnite now Oh, I'm multi mining. It's like that one Minecraft mod too, the multi mine mod. Can I break a tree too? Just give me wood. So what is the point of this game? I have no idea. I'll be honest. <laughs> I think it's just a forage, which I can easily. What's right click do? Okay, right click doesn't do anything. What was space bar? Oh, Dark Souls? You got some Dark Souls in this? I don't know how long this is gonna take. All right, I'm gonna break all these trees. I probably got this out. Ooh, berries. Wait, I can only break one. I can't break this one. No, I was breaking that one. There wasn't a health bar. See you later. Go ahead, roll to the other ones. Ooh. Maybe I'm just supposed to get all the. What was that? Citrus? Maybe I'm supposed to just get all the iron. No. Iron does give you a lot, though. Seems like a, a game. What are these shoes doing? Why are they just like appear? Seems like a game that you just. I should eat. <laughs> how do I open my inventory? I don't know how to open my inventory. How do you open your inventory? Oh. Okay. Alright, interesting. I just ate like everything. I don't know if I was supposed to do that. Let's just start by building a furnace. Just crafting in this? Bro, I didn't even know this is all of this. Okay. Industrial. I would consider a furnace industrial. There you go. Ooh. Can I mind this? We need a better pickaxe or something. I was just gonna grind and see if I can hit level 2. That's the goal. To hit level 2. So we're just gonna do that. Hit that level 2. I just noticed that that is our energy bar in the top left. And it does go down every time I mine. Boom, bada, bin. We just hit level two. So, yeah, I gotta watch that energy bar. Let's. There you go. Full energy. Alright. Let's go ahead and smelt some iron. I don't. I don't have coal? Where do we get coal? Oh, it's just wood? Right. Let's do uh, eight, I guess. So, that's gonna take a while. I mean, while that's going. I'll grab some more wood. So we did just spend a lot of wood. So it's interesting. I'm getting some uh, Minecraft vibes when it comes to you know being on its own island. But let's not do comparisons too quickly. I don't want to be that person and always be comparing stuff like this is the Dark Souls of Minecraft. Like no no no, this is Forager. All right, this is its own game right now. But it makes sense to draw comparisons to other survival games because that's just how that's just how it is in the gaming world today. Can I walk off into the Okay, you can't fall off into the water. It's good. Um Do I have any more food? Because low key I might die. Just low key. So there's skills, feats. You know, if you're into feet. Uh there's building. Farming. Fish trap. Oh fuck. <laughs> I used all my berries. No. Whoa, you could buy land for 630 petunias? I don't know what that is. I don't know why I said petunias. Alright. Oh god, it's nighttime. This is scary. Break more stuff. I don't exactly have a lot of food, actually. <laughs> okay, there you go. We got citrus. Let's eat the citrus. What did I say? Something came up. Alright, we have an iron. Oh, I have a skill point. Yeah. Ooh. Industry, economy, foraging. Definitely foraging. 
Cotton spawns more often. Allows you to find wheat. Allows you to find beets. Oh, hell yeah. Learn. Whoa! Damn. Oh, and then it... Oh, my God. This is cool. Okay, I'm liking this game so far. I'm liking this. Just like I like Blazing Beaks. We don't talk about Blazing Beaks. I know, it's my fault. I was lazy. I just didn't do a play. <laughs> but this time, for real. If you guys like this game, you know, drop some likes. Or just drop a comment saying, "Game Rangers, I like this game." I'll I'll do a I'll do a playthrough for as long as I can, because this game does seem really fun. And I saw one of Fury Forge's thumbnails, so hopefully I didn't spoil anything. I saw some cool cool shit in the thumbnail. I didn't want to watch anything past the thumbnail. I think I watched like the first episode. I won't. I watched like the first couple seconds. Is this wheat? Is where wheat be? All right, hold up. So let's. Our energy is like really low. Um, it's like a farming. Two more berries, man. Forge. I have no idea. What can I do with iron? Like, how do I learn more recipes? Economic. There's a magical option. What the heck? Gear. I don't know what to do. We have five iron. We can sell stuff. How do you sell stuff? I'm assuming economic. You unlock something that you can sell stuff on. We need more berries. I need to make a fish trap. Dude, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna die. If this fish trap doesn't come through, we're gonna die. Please, fish trap. Save me. So how I check it? I don't know. <laughs> I just planted something, and I don't got any energy to do anything else. So this shit better come through. All right. Go ahead and make some gold. Oh, you can't even make stuff all that. Oh, there's some wheat right here. Boom. I got wheat. What do I do with wheat? Can I eat it? What is right clicking? Right clicking looks like it throws it away. All right, I shouldn't right click then. Bro, I need more XP is what I need, but how do I get more XP? Forge. We need brick for a forge. Okay. So I guess that's the plan. Wait. Okay. Flower. Sweet. This looks like we can dig this here. Look, It's looking like if you guys have played Animal Crossing, you guys know where you get the gyroids. Is that what they're called? <laughs> is it gyroid? Gyroid? Uh, and then there's the holes in the floor. This, they're like star-shaped holes in Animal Crossing. This is what this reminds me of. So boom, bada bing. We get a shovel, we dig right there, we good. Oh, it costs some. Oh, you hit eat. Okay, good. I was about to say. I should eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quit complaining. I know you should eat. We're gonna check though if we can actually. Oh wait, here we go. I know, I know, I know, man. I'm trying to, I'm trying to supply you with the food. I want to see if I can actually smell some stuff here. I want to buy some more land, but how do we get these points? We gotta go economic on our next level up. We're almost level two, though. We gotta do more mining, but I don't exactly have the XP to go mining. What is this? Oh, it's a beat. Yes. We got beats. Plus 12 energy. Damn. That's really good. Okay. So, let's go ahead and let's break the rest of these trees. I really need some new land, though. That's very important that we expand at some point in time very soon. But uh, other than that, there's something I want to craft. What the hell was it? I was trying to craft the forge. I have no idea. Oh, slimy pickaxe. Coin. Gold ingots we could turn into coins. Just one coin? I don't want just one coin. Not, oh, we need jelly. I notice that a lot of games like this that have this like view always have slime enemies. <laughs> it's weird. Maybe they don't have. Maybe I'm too quick to assume that this game has slime enemies. But good example: Stardew Valley, the dead people version of Stardew Valley, Gravekeeper. I've seen that game. I was thinking about playing that game, but uh, I don't know. I just noticed that. So what I think I'm going to do, I think I'm going to cut until I make some major progress here, alright? 
So, in this economy tree, it says instantly gain 40 coins. Hell yeah. And that opens up more economy stuff. Sweet. Coinage. Forger creates four extra coins every time. Ooh, that's really good. Locks vaults. What is this? Fallout? We got I should buy land and expand. Not wrong. That's exactly what I was going to do. All right. Well, we're going to go to the right right now. So fuck. Ooh. I knew it. I knew there were slime enemies. What's up, bro? Get some. Get some. Dark Souls. Oh, shit. <laughs> Got him. Let's go. We can't roll off the island. There's a rainbow over here. What's up with this rainbow? Oh, my. This dude got hops. I will not lie. He does indeed have hops. All right. Slimy pickaxe. We just need more iron. Sweet. I can do that easily. Let's just craft some coal. I do I actually need to break a tree? It was about to be nighttime. I don't know if I'm trying to be out here. But, uh, these mushrooms. Did that hurt me? No. I don't know. They don't exactly do much. Just kind of explode. So, do I have food? We have beets. We have a couple berries. Okay, so they tell you what, what they are. Consumable, material, consumable. See, it's consumable. That's nice. Material. I don't know if you could actually, like, build something. You know, like, build, build. I mean, I need more forges, bro. This takes too long. Or not forges. Uh, furnaces. Alright. I don't know how much iron I needed. But we're gonna go for max. Okay. Let's go over here. Um... I need to build a bridge, don't I? Alright, we're gonna build a bridge, but we're gonna do it on the closer side. I just need more wood. What is that? A lightning bug? Hey! Come here. What the fuck? That shit really blocked me off. It's wasting my energy. Lightning bug. Ooh, caught a fish. Give me that fish. Okay. And there's a beet right here, too. I will take the beet because beets seem to be one of our best sources of. Uh, food so let's see here we're gonna build a bridge which costs four wood it's like all my wood and there you go we should be able to go into this rainbow arc but let me just let me just farm up some stuff first all right i am able to craft the slimy pick I, oh my god this is gonna take forever oh that really is gonna take forever though i don't have the recipes for like cotton and stuff yet like, look, I don't have anything unlocked. What level am I? I'm almost, I'm kind of close to level four. But uh, I think we should just head into here. Do I need to build a bridge? I don't know. This feels like something useful. Oh, God, I shouldn't swing my pickaxe like that. <laughs> it actually uses energy. I don't know. I thought this would be something. I feel like I'm just doing something wrong, probably. I probably am. I wouldn't be uh, surprised. Ooh, nice. We caught sand. Wow, <laughs> what an interesting thing to catch. Hey, coal is useful. Let's mine coal. I don't know what I can do with wheat and cotton. Like I said, I don't really have the recipes unlocked to make them useful. So I guess I just won't do much with them. There's also mushrooms. I don't know if we can harvest. I don't know if we need a perk to harvest mushrooms. There we go. Pickaxe upgrade. Damage increased by 75%. Gain 50% more jelly when killing slimes. That's useful. So do we just throw our old one away? Yeah, it seems like we do. So obviously we can get weapons and stuff. What are feats? Is this like if we kill a boss? Ooh, it is. It's like it's like a little like goals and stuff. Okay. There has to be something we can do with this. There's like two different soundtracks playing at the same time. It's really weird. <laughs> okay, um. Let me try and make bridge which means I need more wood but if this doesn't work then bon voyage you know what i'm saying what the hell you guys really just gonna be placing all this in my way when it said 75 percent more pickaxe damage does that mean towards like objects on on the floor that you can mine or does that mean 75 percent more damage towards slimes what the heck did i just make that though no i didn't okay well I think I'm gonna do one more cut. I'm gonna harvest a bunch of stuff. 
and we'll see if we can expand again and then i think i'll end the episode after this all right so it actually took me a really long time to figure out that crafting gold makes eight per or crafting coins makes eight per a gold ingot so we can't buy a new piece of land finally hopefully this levels us up we're so cool we're literally you gonna bait me like that it's worth it though we have to make a key we have to make a key which is four iron ingots two gold ingots got it four iron shit <laughs> Okay, there's some iron over there. Boom, bada bing, we hit another level. I'm at level five now. Um, but yeah, let's get this gold and iron. We should be good. Look at this, two tapping slimes. Can I use jelly for anything else? I feel like jelly you could low-key eat, but I don't make the rules. No, it's a material. It's all good. Uh, let's get some berries. No, I've just been stocking up on berries. No, you never know when you need to hibernate. But yeah. Let's uh, go ahead. I don't remember how much gold it was. Whatever, just craft four gold. Iron. All right, I guess one iron works for now. But uh, we'll keep gathering, I guess. Keep gathering the ores. I, I made it so I can get steel. But I don't think steel is gonna matter too much. Meanwhile, while this is smelting up, we're gonna we're gonna build a bridge. Okay, that might have been. Nah, uh, it's... I don't know. <laughs> I feel like there's a more inf efficient way I could have did it. Alright. I said efficient, not efficient. I might have said efficient, but we're going to pretend that I said efficient. Break down some wood. We need some wood. Wood. Fuck, I don't have inventory space. Go ahead, let's load up. Max food. I need to sell some stuff. How do you sell stuff? How do I drop stuff, too? I don't want to delete all these flowers, but like, I just don't want to hold them either. Oh, we caught some. I did catch an anvil. I don't know what the hell. It says it's a material. So I'm going to trust that it's actually a material. And that'll be useful for something. Bro, we need more iron. I guess we'll wait for some iron. Let's finish the bridge. Which I don't even think I have enough to finish the bridge. I need four more wood. Finish the bridge and then we're gonna look at uh, the steel tree. We'll wait for iron to grow because iron has not grown anywhere. I get my hair and stuff growing, but it ain't iron. It, it, oh, damn, bro. I didn't know you can make it over here. Okay. Uh, I, got, I still gotta get used to the menus. There's some iron right there. Give me that iron. What? The chest. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, what an inconvenience. Okay, hold up. Alright, break this tree right here. I don't know if that's enough. Break one more tree. Go ahead, snack on a fish real quick. And we gotta build a damn bridge. <laughs> just to just to get this iron. But it's worth it. The iron is very much needed. 100 percent worth it right here. There's a chicken. Come here, chicken. Wait. Gives you eggs? Bro, I gotta keep it. I was gonna kill it, but <laughs> I didn't know it gave you eggs. Alright, let's look at a perk here. Or at least attempt to get a perk here. From the skill tree. Perk skills, whatever. Same thing. You don't think about it. Uh what is this? Gathering. Gain four more inventory spots? Yo. That's pretty fucking good. How's he to find fairies? Okay. Yeah, whatever. Unlock vaults. <clears throat> it's either. Oh, man, I don't know. This is definitely useful. The coinage and then gathering is definitely useful. I think we go with coinage until we. Uh, nah, fuck it. Let's just get coinage. <laughs> Gotta get that coinage. I'm a coin type person. Banking. Lots of banks. Trade. There we go. That's what I was looking for. That's what I was looking for. Was trade. But uh, I don't know, are we able to make the key yet? What am I missing? I still need gold. As you, as you can see, I'm missing some health. Right when I went into my inventory, apparently a slime popped out and hit me. I literally had no chance to react to it because I was in my inventory looking at something else. It's all good though, it's only one heart. We'll get it back. I don't know how though. There's that rainbow. I feel like that rainbow does something. I just haven't figured it out yet. Can I make the key? Oh, we, we gotta smelt it. Go ahead. We just need one more bar anyway, so we should be good. 
Uh, let me make sure I got open inventory spots. <laughs> Definitely do not. It's all good. We'll just munch on some stuff. There you go. Should be good now. Key has been crafted. Oh, God. That's going to take a little bit. <laughs> what is that? Is that a pig? What's a pig? It doesn't really seem like I can cra catch him. So, uh... <laughs> Very sorry, little piggy. All right, let's open it up. Ooh, vampire wings recover health when killing enemies. What? I could fly over stuff now. Wait, no, is that just a bug? Oh. <laughs> I, was, I was very surprised. Ooh, gain health when killing enemies. Guess what? Put it to use. We just gained some health killing that enemy. Wow, how useful was that? All right, I'm gonna unlock the trading thing, and I think. We are gonna be done with this first episode, possible first episode of the series. I don't know, you guys tell me, this game is very relaxing. I like relaxing games. So, there you go, there's my there's my opinion on the game. Hey, make sure you check it out on Steam, just so like it can help the Steam algorithm, you know, help it show up more when people are on Steam. And remember, it is in closed beta, so any bugs and stuff that happen, uh, that's the reason why it's still in beta. But yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Gboy106. I'll see y'all next time. Tell me if you want me to do more episodes of this. Yes, no, or no, yes. I don't, I don't, I don't care. You tell me in the comments.